Okay, well, we've got the um, clear coat on, colour and clear coat. It's looking fab. Really liking the way it's come out. Bit of orange peel on there, which we'll sort out later. Uh, but the more immediate problem is I've got quite a run here. Quite a bad run. So, you should be able to see that okay. Hopefully, just there. And there. So we're going to try a trick from the gunman to get rid of that using a bit of fine filler. So we'll come back to that in two ticks. Okay, so um, we've got a, just a light covering of filler in here. We're going to wet sand it. And we're going to start with some 320 and work up from there. Um, you can't wet sand metallic paint. Um, it alters the, the, the metallic finish. But this is clear coat, so it's okay to, to wet sand this. But we need to be careful that I don't go through the clear coat. And that's the idea of the filler, is to protect the clear coat um, around the area of the run. So all we should do is hit the high spots of the actual run itself. Hopefully. That's the theory. Now I'm moving on to a 600 grit. Now the danger with this is that you go through the paint, and I think I might have done that there. Gone through the clear coat and through the colour coat. I'm just going to have to touch that up afterwards. And touch that in. Let's see how we get on. So I've ditched the block because I think it's too aggressive on these corners where the paint is a little bit thinner. It's too aggressive. So we're just going to do it with fingertips now. And the 600. Right, now we're on to the 800. Give that a little go. Right, now ideally, the lights have gone to thousand or twelve hundred and then on to fifteen hundred but I haven't got any so we're going straight on to the fifteen hundred hopefully that will get rid of any scratch marks and the last little remnants fill up And then what we'll do, we'll come back and we'll panel wipe this and we'll be able to see if there's blue on the wipe then we know that I've actually gone through the clear coat into the colour coat. So we'll have to have a look at that and just see how we come out. Right, I've got one to do on the other side as well. So we'll go around and do that now. Right, so um, panel wiped it. That's all nice and smooth now. The run is gone and it's not through the clear coat. So although you can see a, 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 a difference in shininess here, uh, that will come out with polishing and, and a bit more clear coat on the top. So, because um, this is all going to be dulled down anyway, ready for the um, flow coat. So I'm going to go over this with uh, 1500 grit um, to ed edge it down a little bit, and then we're going to flow coat it. So this will come out, hopefully. In this bit here, I had some debris blew against this. And so again, I've just taken that down, just a bit of 800 grit, took the debris off, 1500 over the top. That's pretty much squared away now. So I need to get some 1500 paper. We're gonna do all this, get rid of the orange peel, take it back, very careful not to go through the clear coat onto the um, color coat underneath. And then hopefully we can flow coat on the top and that, that should come up looking really nice.